If you are planning to control the SQ using MIDI over TCP IP, or more commonly to allow wireless control with the SQ Mixpad app, you will need to connect the SQ to a network. The SQ connects to a network in a similar way to a computer. Just use a standard network cable to connect the network port on the rear of the SQ to an available LAN port. Due to the amount of data transferred when using the SQ Mixpad app, we recommend you use a dedicated network for wireless control, so the most common setup only requires a wireless router. Having a separate wireless connection allows you to choose a suitable router for your situation. In a small venue or one with very little Wi-Fi traffic, an inexpensive router will suffice, but in other cases you may find a more powerful router is required. Straight out of the box, most routers will assign an IP address using DHCP to any connected device, and so the SQ also has DHCP enabled by default. You can check this by pressing the Setup screen key and going to Network Setup. If you are not comfortable with changing the network settings, it is best to leave DHCP set to On. This screen also allows you to change the device name on the network, which is useful if multiple SQs are connected. So with DHCP on and the SQ connected to a LAN port on your router, you should see activity LEDs flashing. Then by going to the Utility General Diagnostics page, you will be able to check that a valid IP address has been assigned. At this point, you can connect your wireless device to the wireless network and open SQ Mixpad. The SQ unit name will be displayed in the list of connection options, so just select this and touch the connect button to start controlling the desk remotely.